This is Dr. B, and we're going to look at the number of valence electrons for hydrogen. So these valence electrons, they're in the highest energy level of an atom. They're the ones that are involved in chemical bonds. Hydrogen right here, it's in group one. And this is the trend that we have for valence electrons. Group one has one valence electron. Group two has two valence electrons. All of these here have two valence electrons. Skip the transition metals. They do have valence electrons. That's a little more complicated. Group 13 has three, four, five, six, seven, all the way up to group 18, which has eight. Except helium, helium only has two valence electrons, but all these here have eight. So that's the trend. Here's hydrogen. It has one valence electron. Let me show you why that is. Hydrogen's atomic number is one, so it only has one proton in the nucleus. And that means, since these are neutral, it only has one electron. So let's build a hydrogen atom. We put our one proton in the nucleus, and then we have one electron. It's in this energy level here, the first energy level. In the first energy level, it can only hold two. After two, it goes to a new energy level. So hydrogen, it'll bond to get two electrons and fill this highest energy level. So right now we have one. So two hydrogen atoms, they come together. Each one has one valence electron. So the two hydrogen atoms, when they come together, they're going to share that valence electron. And they share it, and now we have a covalent bond. This hydrogen has two, and this hydrogen has two. So hydrogen, we get H2, and it's very stable because it's sharing these electrons, and it's like each one of them has two. So hydrogen has one valence electron. And again, this is a really useful trend to know when we're looking at valence electrons, group one, two, group 13 has three, 14 has four, all the way to group 18, which has eight valence electrons, except helium that only has two. This is Dr. B looking at the valence electrons for hydrogen and the general trend. Thanks for watching.